Russia stunned the world when it unveiled the Su-57 masterpiece at the Zhuhai Air Show in China this November. With its outstanding features, this fighter jet not only marks a significant leap forward for Russia, but also leaves competitors like the U.S. quote, SF-35 and China's J-20 wary. Notably, the Su-57 has already secured its first export order, poised to dominate the skies and reshape the global air combat landscape. So why could it be a potential game changer? What might other nations face? Let's dive in and find out. The Su-57, known by its NATO codename Felon, is a fifth-generation multi-role stealth fighter jet. It represents a groundbreaking achievement by the Sukhoi Design Bureau, a subsidiary of Russia's United Aircraft Corporation. Developed under the PAC-FA program, the Su-57 signifies Russia's leap into advanced military aviation, setting a new standard for aerial combat. As Russia's first stealth multi-role fighter, it is designed to replace Soviet-era legends like the MiG-29 and Su-27 while standing toe-to-toe -to -toe with contemporary stealth icons such as the US F-35 Lightning II and China's J-20. At first glance, the Felon embodies the quintessential features of a modern fighter jet, but its fusion of blistering speed, unmatched agility, and cutting-edge stealth capabilities elevates it to an entirely new level. Among its standout technologies is the N036 Bielka radar system, a marvel of engineering capable of tracking multiple targets over long distances, leaving adversaries virtually no chance to evade detection. This radar is further complemented by advanced electronic warfare systems, enabling the felon not only to identify threats, but also to disrupt enemy communications and radar systems, effectively blinding opponents in combat. So what makes the Su-57 such a formidable weapon of war? First and foremost, its stealth profile is a defining factor that sets it apart from its competitors. Unlike traditional fighter jets that rely on external weapon mounts, it stores its arsenal within internal bays, significantly reducing its radar cross-section and preserving its stealth advantage during combat. The use of radar-absorbing materials across its airframe further enhances its ability to evade enemy detection systems. Even when equipped with powerful air-to-air -air and air-to-ground missiles, the Felon maintains its ghost-like presence on radar, enabling it to strike before adversaries have a chance to react. Secondly, the Su-57's fearsome reputation isn't solely built on its radar systems and stealth capabilities. Its thrust-vectoring nozzles provide exceptional maneuverability, enabling the aircraft to execute complex aerial acrobatics that few rivals can match. Paired with its twin-engine configuration, this fighter achieves supercruise, sustained supersonic flight without relying on afterburners. This capability offers a significant edge in high-speed engagements, allowing it to outpace and outmaneuver adversaries with unmatched efficiency. Thirdly, what truly sets the Su-57 apart as a nightmare for its adversaries is its integrated laser system. Far from the realm of science fiction, this advanced technology can blind enemy sensors and targeting systems, rendering threats powerless before they can retaliate. Moreover, its ability to deploy directed energy weapons and command drones cements its reputation as a fighter jet ahead of its time. The Su-57's impressive features are undeniable on paper, but the ultimate test of any combat aircraft lies in its real-world performance. Russia has wasted no time showcasing its might in action, deploying it in Syria to gather critical data on its capabilities under combat pressure and harsh operational conditions. Is that all? Absolutely not. The Su-57 is far more than meets the eye. As military technology advances, the Su-57 is poised to evolve, ensuring its dominance in the skies remains unchallenged. One of its key strengths lies in its adaptability to emerging threats and mission demands. The Russian military is committed to continuously upgrading the aircraft with cutting-edge avionics, weapon systems, and state-of-the-art technologies, including plans to integrate hypersonic weaponry. This development will dramatically enhance its strike capabilities, enabling it to engage high-value targets from staggering distances at lightning-fast speeds. Furthermore, the integration of artificial intelligence AI, and advanced data processing will be a game-changer for the operational effectiveness of the Su-57. AI systems can analyze massive amounts of data in real time, dramatically enhancing decision making in complex missions. This capability will elevate the felon's situational awareness and responsiveness, allowing it to excel in multi-domain environments where threats evolve rapidly and unpredictably. 
The synergy between the Su-57 and unmanned aerial vehicles, UAV for short, like the S-70 Okotnik B, will further amplify its capabilities. This partnership has the potential to revolutionize aerial combat, as this aircraft can spearhead missions, orchestrate coordinated attacks, and leverage UAV for reconnaissance and electronic warfare. By integrating manned and unmanned systems, the Russian military can execute intricate operations with unparalleled precision while minimizing risk to pilots. This cutting-edge collaboration ensures that the felon remains at the forefront of air warfare, setting new standards for dominance in the skies. In Syria, the Su-57 has demonstrated its formidable capabilities, primarily engaging in precision airstrikes while maintaining its stealth advantage, undetectable by enemy radar. Reports confirm the felon's successful deployment of advanced weapon systems, including precision-guided munitions and state-of-the-art air-to-air missiles. Its radar-absorbing stealth materials and sophisticated electronic warfare systems have ensured that the felon operates like a ghost on the battlefield, invisible to adversary detection. With supercruise capabilities and thrust vectoring maneuvers, it has proven itself an unparalleled force, dominating both the skies and ground targets with unwavering efficiency, leaving no room for interference. The true test for the Su-57 lies in its performance against global rivals in real-world combat, as its ultimate effectiveness will depend on its field performance. So how will it measure against the most advanced fighter jets in the world? The Felon is often compared to the F-35, with both aircraft developed to secure supremacy in air combat while handling a variety of missions. The aircraft focuses on extraordinary maneuverability and high speed reflecting Russia's Air Force doctrine and pushing the boundaries of agility and velocity. In contrast, the F-35 is designed to emphasize versatility, excelling in air combat, ground strikes, and reconnaissance. It is optimized for seamless integration into a networked combat environment, aligning with NATO's modern operational strategy. The Su-57 and F-35, each embodying their respective nation's strategic priorities, set the stage for fierce competition in the skies. First, the Su-57's stealth capabilities are not its top priority, although the aircraft uses radar-absorbing materials combined with aerodynamic design. This results in a larger radar cross-section, especially from side or rear angles. In contrast, the F-35 stands out with its superior stealth due to composite materials and an optimized shape, which significantly reduces radar cross-section from all angles. Second, in terms of performance, the Su-57 is powered by two Saturn AL-41F1 afterburning turbofan engines, each capable of producing a dry thrust of 88.3 kilonewtons and an afterburner thrust of 142.2 kilonewtons, with an emergency power setting yielding 147.1 kilonewtons. It allows Su-57 to have a maximum speed of Mach 2.0, which is about 2,135 kilometers per hour, a service ceiling of 20,000 meters, and a range of 3,500 kilometers without refueling. The aircraft excels in supermaneuverability thanks to its 3D thrust vectoring system, allowing for complex aerial maneuvers in combat. Meanwhile, the F-35 has a maximum speed of Mach 1.6, which is approximately 1,930 kilometers per hour a service ceiling of 15,240 meters, and a range of 2,220 kilometers. In this aspect, Su has completely surpassed the F-35 to become outstanding. The Su-57 boasts superior speed and maneuverability, while the F-35 focuses on advanced avionics and stealth. Which factor do you believe is more crucial in air combat? Comment 1 if your answer is Su-57, 2 if it is F-35. Third, the Su-57 is equipped with a wide range of weaponry, including air-to-air, air-to-ground missiles, and even hypersonic weapons currently under development. It can carry 10 to 12 types of weapons in internal or external hardpoints. The standout feature of the Su-57 is its powerful long-range strike capabilities, making it highly effective in precision attacks. In contrast, the F-35 integrates advanced missiles such as the AIM-120D, JDAM precision-guided bombs, and a variety of other weapon systems. The F-35 can carry four to six weapons internally, with the capacity to increase this number when external hardpoints are used, prioritizing high-precision covert missions in complex operational environments. Furthermore, 
The Su-57 is equipped with a multiband active electronically scanned array radar and advanced sensors to detect targets at long ranges. Russia is also developing artificial intelligence systems to assist pilots in the future. On the other hand, the F-35 boasts the world's most advanced avionics systems, including the active electronically scanned array, an APG-81 radar, and the distributed aperture system sensors. The F-35's ability to share real-time data with other units creates a highly effective networked combat environment, enhancing its situational awareness and operational coordination. As of 2024, Russia has produced fewer than 20 Su-57 aircraft, with plans to accelerate production in the future. However, economic and technological challenges are hindering this process. In contrast, over 1,000 F-35S have been produced and are serving in multiple air forces around the world. This aircraft has been widely exported, becoming a popular choice among U.S. allies. In addition, the production cost of each Su-57 is estimated at around 40 to 50 million, significantly lower than the F-35. However, this lower cost comes with the absence of some advanced technologies. The F-35 costs around 80 to 100 million USD per unit, not including high maintenance and operational costs, but in return, it boasts the most advanced technology in the world. This comparison highlights the strengths of each aircraft. Do you think the Su-57 has a strong competitive edge against the F-35? Feel free to share your thoughts in the comments. Not only has the Su-57 made a significant impact in Russia, but it has also captured the attention of defense industries and military analysts around the globe. Many view the Felon as a game-changer in the ever-evolving landscape of air combat, where the balance of power is constantly shifting. Its advanced features challenge traditional notions of aerial supremacy, forcing other nations to reconsider their strategies. India, despite previously withdrawing from the Felon Development Partnership, continues to monitor the aircraft's progress closely. Indian military experts are closely evaluating whether it can meet the country's future combat needs, especially as India seeks to modernize its air force to address regional challenges. Furthermore, the emergence of this fighter jet has prompted other nations to accelerate their research and development of advanced combat technologies. The US, China, and NATO members are intensifying investments in sixth-generation combat systems to ensure they don't fall behind in the race for air superiority. But is the Su-57 truly as flawless as Russia claims? And how do global military powers assess this formidable fighter jet? At the Zhuhai Air Show in China, Russia's felon stealth aircraft may have found its first export customer. We can expect a clearer demonstration of the aircraft once it officially enters service. Of course, the Su-57 is not without its challenges. Slow production, financial, and technical issues, along with reliance on engines that are not yet fully perfected, have led to criticism both domestically and internationally. Some Western analysts argue that despite this aircraft's impressive features, its real-world deployment and mass production capability remain major uncertainties. However, it cannot be denied that this fighter jet has set a new standard in air combat. With its stealth design, advanced weapon systems, and superior operational capabilities, it represents a significant leap forward in military aviation technology. In the future, the Su-57 could become a key strategic asset not only for Russia, but also for other countries seeking alternatives to advanced fighter jets like the F-35. Certainly, improvements in stealth technology, sensors, and weapons will help this fighter maintain an edge in aerial confrontations. What do you think about the fifth generation Su-57 fighter jet? Could it dominate the military world? Thank you for following along. Feel free to leave a comment. See you in the next episode.